Absolutely. President Trump should be expunged. President Trump should be expunged. President Trump should be expunged. Thank you, Marjorie. I'm just saying what I've been dying to say. <laughs> what Green was attempting to say was that Trump's impeachments should be expunged or erased. But words are not an MTG strong suit. And in that Newsmax interview, Green's words and comments got even sillier. It began when Green was asked about getting kicked out of the far-right House Freedom Caucus. Uh, thoughts on, on not being part of that? Well, I'm not interested in games, and I'm not interested in pulling pranks. Not interested in games or pulling pranks? Huh? Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez, I'm an American citizen. I pay your salary. If you want to be a big girl, you need to get rid of your diaper and come out and be able to talk to the American citizens instead of us having to use a flap, a little flap. So I didn't get engaged in silly fight, fights and, and anti-leadership fights because I saw those as a complete waste of time. Wait, you did not get involved in anti-leadership fights because you saw those as a complete waste of time. Your personal opinion and your wish was that Congress not certify Joe Biden as the winner of the 2020 election. Uh, no, that's not accurate. Not accurate. Hmm. You can't allow it to just transfer power peacefully like Joe Biden wants. I'm not interested in just fighting leadership. I think that's a complete waste of time. So in that Newsmax interview, maybe you were talking about House Republican leadership fights. You didn't get involved except when you fought with Republicans who disagreed with you, like Lauren Boebert. Marjorie Taylor Greene and Lauren Boebert kept on fighting. And according to the Daily Beast, Marjorie Taylor Greene called Lauren Boebert a little bitch on the House floor. Order, please. Uh, the voters in my district sent me to Washington to get things accomplished, and that's why I'm here. To get things accomplished? None of your legislative efforts have become law or changed laws. A lot of your amendments and proposals, though, have been defeated in epic fashion. And number two, printed in the congressional record, offered by Mrs. Ms. Green of Georgia. A recorded vote is requested. Those supporting a recorded vote will rise. On this vote, the yeas are 14, the nays are 418. The amendment is not agreed to. Where we can make a real difference for conservatives across America, like you, Eric, like myself, like the great people in my district, um, and many hardworking Americans, is making sure that our appropriation bills serve America first and make sure that they spend the American people's tax dollars appropriately. Spending tax dollars appropriately, like asking for tens of millions of dollars to fund an impeachment inquiry against Joe Biden and justifying the request based on an unscientific survey you posted to your social media. At 5 p.m. yesterday, I released a survey simply on my social media asking, do you support impeachment? 8,600 people responded, and that was just from 5 p.m. last night. 77% said yes, they support impeachment. Only 23% oppose. Well, I believe that if you surveyed Republicans in Congress anonymously, a majority would agree with this public declaration by Republican Senator Mitt Romney. Marjorie Taylor Greene and Paul Gosar, I don't know them, but I'm reminded of that old line from the Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid movie where, where one character says, morons, I've got morons on my team. Is moron too harsh? In my view, Marjorie Greene keeps making the case, and oftentimes in hilarious fashion. Now we have Nancy Pelosi's gazpacho police spying on members of Congress. Absolutely. President Trump should be expunged. Mm. Tell me your thoughts in the comment section. By the way, MAGA supporters of Green and Donald Trump keep underscoring all of their ignorance. He's the most unifying president ever in history, and all the numbers show it. He was a little more honest than the rest of them. Uh, he, he said things that, uh, that were true, and the others, they, they don't. Check out that video at the link below. I'm David Schuster. Thanks for joining us.